Hello and welcome to Inkscape for Teachers. In this tutorial I'll be showing you one way to create a railway track effect. It's much the same as this one. So I'll scroll down and first we'll create the uh, general path of the track. So using the Bezier pen tool I'll click, click and drag, click and enter. Let's say that was the path that I wanted. Now you can edit that but um, let's assume you've got your path as you want it. Now I'm going to draw the uh, plank that goes across the track or the railway sleeper I guess you'd call it and B for the Bezier pen tool or click this icon here again click, shift click um, and click again and enter and I might change that to uh, one millimeter stroke enter okay now select the path first then shift click to select the sleeper under extensions generate from path pattern along path and repeated snake, you can see the, the settings here, this changes the spacing I'll uh, click a live preview and that's OK if you get the uh, sleepers going the wrong way you can uh, click this here because that's not going to help in this instance because I already drew it vertical apply and close and there's the, uh, there are the tracks, now that may be enough for what you want on a map icon or something but uh, I'm going to thicken up this line here now, I'll zoom in and click that line and let's make it uh, 10 mil thick yep that looks good but uh, what I'm going to do is go path and stroke to path and give it no fill, click this here and shift click the black to give it a black boundary but uh, I don't want the boundary this thick, I just want it 1 mil thick like the sleepers and enter and there we have the, the track now one bit you might want to tidy up here is if I just uh, click on this and control shift K to break it apart in, into the individual bits if I click on that and delete you might not want this bit here so I'll click on that, end for the node tool drag around there and select break at selected nodes then control shift K to actually break it apart select tool and delete that last little bit up here the same thing I might click that one and delete it but I don't want this joined so I'll click it, enter the node tool select both of those nodes break apart and control shift K to force the break apart select tool, click away and delete that one that might look a bit better you can uh, shorten this, let's say let's click on that one and enter the node tool, let's say I wanted to break about there double click, put in a new node break it at that node, control shift K and select tool and then you can delete that little bit so it's more consistent with this one over here okay so there's how you can uh, create a railway track effect using the extensions path effect editor thanks for watching